Hey guys, so first I'm going to use the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer and I love this primer because it just fills in the pores perfectly and smooths your face out to where it literally feels like a baby's butt. But yeah, I love this primer and I use it all the time and that was just a sample so it was like super small but that primer seriously works wonders. Then I'll be going in with the Makeup Forever HD Foundation. I'm going to be basically applying this foundation everywhere and I'm also going to bring it upwards towards the forehead um, and just kind of like blending that backwards so that everything blends well and there's not like a line, you know what I mean? Um, and then I'm also going to go down the neck. I'm just going to be blending that backwards um, just so that everything blends seamlessly and looks very natural. Then I'm going to be going in with the e.l.f. Camo Concealer in the shade Light Beige. And I'm just going to be using this to highlight all the natural areas that your face would normally highlight. Um, and where the light would hit. So I'm just going to be concealing under the eyes. Yeah, and just like blending that backwards towards the temples. Um, just to create that, um, you know, that light effect. And I'm going to be using that with the same brush that I used for the foundation. These concealers are amazing. The new e.l.f. Um, camo concealers and also the hydrating ones. Um, these concealers are literally so amazing. I love them so much. They are so creamy. They're literally a dupe for the Tarte Shape Tape. The Tarte Shape Tape is seriously so expensive. Like why? Like why is it $20? I'm not too sure. Um, and the e.l.f. concealers are only $3, so if you put two and two together, come on, you're getting literally the best deal ever, and they work just as good. Then I'm be going in with the ABH translucent powder, and I'm just going to be, um, powdering everywhere that I just applied liquid, so under her eyes, um, all over her face, down her neck, and brushed backwards. Then I'm going to be going in with that same concealer and I'm going to be applying that to her eyelids just to prep for the eyeshadow. And I'm going to be going in with colorful eyeshadows, so I'm not going to be setting this um, concealer at all just so we have like a tacky base. And also you're going to get the best pigment out of your eyeshadows. Um, yeah, so if you don't set them with powder, they work very well. Well, they work very well regardless because of this palette but um so i'm gonna be using the ColourPop she's a rainbow palette and i'm literally obsessed with this palette it's amazing and i'm just gonna be applying that neon orange and neon pink um to her eyelids but i'm not really gonna be diffusing them yet i'm just gonna be applying the product and just kind of like um ombre -ing, ombre -ing, i don't know like you know ombre -ing. anyways Then we we'll be using the shade Seeing Stars. This is like a little shimmery purple. And I'm just going to be applying that to her eyelids just to create like a little dark to neon moment, I guess. Um, then I'm going to be applying the concealer where I'm not going to be like cutting the crease or anything like that. I'm just going to be applying this concealer just so that I can use it as a base to get the most pigment that I can from the shadows. This is literally the prettiest pressed glitter I've ever seen in my entire life. ColourPop has the best palettes, so affordable. Like if you are looking to get into makeup or you are looking into getting a new palettes, I definitely recommend checking them out. You can use my code CARLY5 for that $5 off your purchase. Um, but yeah, I cannot recommend them more. They're literally so amazing. 
so next I'm gonna be going in with that seeing stars again. Look at that pigment. Are you joking? Are you joking? Come on. Then I'm be going in with a Maybelline Blackest Black Gel Liner. And I don't usually use gel liners, but it was just super easy to use, um, especially for the look I was going for. So I used that on like a Morphe angled brush. And I basically just like created like a small wing and then filled it in, you know. I find wings to be super easy, especially when I do them on other people. But when I do them on myself, you know, I can't see the top of my eyelid as good as I can see someone else's top of their eyelid. You know what I mean? I'm just creating that wing and also this gel eyeliner was so opaque i literally love it i just loved it like you know what i mean you see you see what i'm seeing like it just looks so amazing then i'm be going in with that coral shade again i'm gonna be applying that under her lower lash line and then going in with that hot pink shade as well and just applying that underneath too with a like definer brush I'm gonna be going in with this cream gel liner from ColourPop, and it's just one of their like colored liners. And I'm just gonna be applying that on her lower lash line, just a tad. Then just applying lashes, and yeah, the eyes are done. Then I'm going in with the MAC Gimme Sun Bronzer. You guys know I love this bronzer so freaking much. And I'm just going to be bronzing her face. I'm going to be using this Morphe bronzing brush. I will have all the products in the description below. And I'm just going to be bronzing around her forehead. She's being so cute. I literally love her. Um, and just bronzing her cheeks. And yeah, everywhere. Just giving it kind of that like golden sun-kissed kind of look and that's why i love this bronzer because it does make you look so sun-kissed like you were just out you got a fresh tan you just got back from florida like it just gives you that those vibes you know then i'm going in with the milani luminoso baked powder blush now if you watch any beauty guru videos on youtube you know that this is the number one holy grail blush that everyone loves so if you are looking to get a perfect blush that is universal i highly recommend you go to your drugstore and you pick this one up it gives you like the perfect most pretty healthy looking blush then i'll be going in with the morphe setting spray i love this setting spray you if you haven't got it you need to get it that's all i'm gonna say and then i'm going in with the mac hyper real glow highlighting kit and i'm just going to be using the middle shade and just highlighting all the places just so she looks like healthy glowy dewy just i love that kind of look that like healthy natural glow um that's just kind of like the idea i'm you know going off of like just highlighting all the spots where you know the sun already hits naturally and just emphasizing that yeah and then just adding the morphe liquid lipstick in the shade virgin and we are done um i love you kaylee i had so much fun creating this look on you and meeting you and building a friendship with you um i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a big thumbs up and make sure to subscribe make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and i will see you guys in my next video